Sweeties here. I got Chloe from McPherson's. She is a silicone kit. A rather expensive one. I have not touched expensive. But she's super, super cute. And we're going to cut her open. Well, her box, anyway. I had to cover up all my stuff. I don't want people with my address. That's creepy. But... It's Chloe, it's Chloe, it's a Linda Murray doll. I am in love with Linda Murray as an artist. She's fabulous, wonderful, best one out there. I guess that's an opinion piece, but gee, look, it's the baby doll. It's the baby. Oh yeah, th those other baby parts. That That's a boo-boo in progress of being fixed. We'll just ignore the boo-boo for now. She has her certificate of authenticity. Which I don't care about because it's not the cute doll. Mailing slip. We are going to dump baby from box. Oh, McPherson's body. I did get her a different body because I don't particularly like the ones that they send with the dolls. But, Chloe, Chloe, Chloe. A little bag. It's a bag of baby body parts. It's kind of creepy. But I bet she's really squishy. I think I peed my pants when the box showed up. But it's alright. I got a fresh pair. We're good to go. No pee pants. Oh. Look at, look at. It's like baby in a bag. It's bag of baby. Miss Chloe. It just tells you what she is. Ecoflex 20, light skin. Congratulations, Chloe. You have light skin. And a thank you thing from McPherson's. But anyways, the dolls, right? So, oop. I think it's foot. Yeah. They are sticky. Okay, thanks child for the interruption. But anyways, real child. Real children problems. Now let's look at fake children. Look at that squishy. Look at how squishy. Look at that squishy. So, it, it, I've only worked with Ashton Drake dolls. So, to put that into perspective for you, let's look at a Boo Boo Ashton Drake doll. They're very, very hard. These are very, very soft. See? Ooh, squishy. Anyways, now I have to make sure I scrub that thing because Ashton Drake's are tin silicone and I won't be able to paint her if I don't clean her. Oh, look at the little footies. Look at that cute little foot foot. These cute, cute toes. I love this baby. Look at that chunky leg. Chunk monk. She's so cute. She has lots of little divots, details. I'm going to have fun painting this one. I like chubby babies. Super cute. Super cute. This one's smaller. I think it's an arm. Dude, I got an arm. It is it's a cute little arm. No, her arms are kind of kind of skinny, actually, compared to her legs. Fingers are thick enough, I guess, if one was so inclined, they could separate them. I probably won't because that's kind of sort of where the boo-boos started with the doll I'm working on now. But she's squishy. Look how cute. That is adorable. Little wrinkles. That's another chubby leg. Chub chub chub. Let's get these babies. Oh. You know, Linda Murray kind of has a thing for these little puffs under the toes. Like... This was in Ava as well. Ava's a Linda Murray from Ash and Drake. That's the boo-boo baby, but she really does puff these up. Oh, I love them little toes. They're so cute. Ooh, everything's stuck to it. Even though there's lots of stuff sticking to this, um, this blank doll baby kit is less sticky than an Ash and Drake completed kit. Like, seriously, this is way less stick than their finished product, so. Look at that job, 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 job. 
Oh my gosh, she's totes adorbs. I think there's another arm. Let me get out of it. <gasps> Look at her fingers. They're so cute. Eh, you might be able to separate those. Not sure if I will. But they're super cute anyway. Yeah, I, I didn't really think her arms were this skinny. That's kind of odd. Since her legs are so chubby. But I'm not complaining. Oh my god. She's, well, sort of tattered, but she does have a cute thank you sticker, I guess. Look, she has the little bee. So her head is actually really, really heavy. Heavier than I thought it would be, of course. The Ashton Drake dolls, they really, they, they have a piece of foam in the middle. And so it's not, it's like kind of a thin layer of silicone, really. They're not exactly, um, yeah, they're definitely not full silicone. So she is definitely heavier than I'm used to. I'm going to need like some kind of stand or something to stick her head on to paint and I want to be able to handle the thing. God, that's gargantuan. Look at it. Look at the shape of her head. That's the little newborn shape. Oh, it's okay. Oh my gosh, she's sweet. Look at her little ears. So cute. That's the other one. Ooh, she has a little thing there. Eh, it came off. Look at the neck rolls. The neck rolls. Oh my gosh, she's too cute. Try and peel this off without leaving stickies behind. But that face. Oh my god, look at her. Look at her so cute. She kind of has some room for a binky. You have to cut her eyes out, put new ones in. But she's super cute. It's greasy, it's greasy, it's greasy. It's greasy, greasy, greasy. I love her. And she has some. Nice little divots, dimples. She kind of has her fontanelle that's sunken in. She's gorgeous. I love her. I cannot wait to paint her. In like five years when I finally get an Ashton Drake one to turn out right. Because $800, $250. You know? Big difference in price. So I don't want to boo-boo this kit like I boo-booed the Ashton Drake. That would really suck. But that's Chloe. She's super cute. I bet the best $800 I spend, even though mom has to show me, I have to go bye-bye. She can't keep me. <gasps> Shh, Chloe, don't tell secrets. That's Chloe. Hooray. We'll be back when I'm painting her. Thanks, everyone. Bye.